David Campanile here with uh, owner of Campanile Law located in the great state of New Jersey. Uh, as always, if you'd like to talk estate planning with me, uh, you can reach me at njestateattorney.com. Uh, I handle estate planning and probate. So today's topic is something that I get a question a lot from even just friends, uh, not necessarily clients, is do I really need a will? <laughs> And I have to sit back and think, and, you know, the answer is, and I kind of had to extrapolate it and say, does everyone re need a will? Well, everyone doesn't need a will. And then the question becomes, well, who doesn't need a will? So in New Jersey, the probate process is really uh, easy. We adopted the Uniform Probate Code back in uh, 2014 or 2015. So uh, we're pretty much uniform, and it's probate is inexpensive, but who doesn't need a will? Well, New Jersey has laws written or statutes that say, okay, if you don't have a will, here's the order of how your a state is going to be handled. A, if A doesn't exist, to B, if B doesn't exist, C, if C doesn't exist, to the state. So if you're fine with that line of su succession and you're comfortable with the New Jersey uh, probate laws, then you don't need a will. There Also, ways to avoid probate would be beneficiary, beneficiary designations, transfer on death accounts, and transfer upon death deeds. Um, so there are ways around probate. There are ways around not having a will, not needing a will. Um, so, but, but that's just a will. Estate planning is more than just, here's a will, you're set. There are other important documents involved, and those documents are your power of attorney, your medical power of attorney, and your living will um, or medical directive. So these forms, these two, three other forms or documents are used when you're still alive but incapacitated. So, and imagine, um, you know, we look at, I don't know, um, famous, I'm trying to think, but you know, you, you're, you're in a car accident. You're, you're in, um, you're walking across the crosswalk. Somebody misses the red light, hits you. You're in the hospital. You're in a coma. You're, you're incapacitated. Somebody has to make a decision for you. Somebody had, you have to leave instructions on how to care for you or, nominate someone who's going to make those decisions on your behalf um, just because without it we run into a lot of other issues so these forms are highly important and probably the most important of the estate planning forms um, because it's when you're alive and that's when they're functioning um, so I guess to sum it all up not everyone really needs a will if you're comfortable with the with the laws, with the statutes in New Jersey, and you have your beneficiary designations, uh, transfer on death accounts, and transfer upon death deeds done, you really don't necessarily need a will. All I'm going to say is make sure you speak to a, your estate planning attorney or to an attorney before implementing any of these things because everybody's uh, situation is different, and this could work for only a limited amount of people. Um so, again, my name is David Campanile, owner of Campanile Law, located in the great state of New Jersey. We handle estate planning and probate. If you'd like to talk probate, it, if you'd like to talk estate planning with me, it is free. Contact me at njestateattorney.com. If you like this video, um, please hit the like button, uh, smash subscribe if you're watching on YouTube, um, and have a great day.